Hello everyone, my name is Ella, welcome to another vlog. I know what you're wondering, why am I sitting in my car? Yes, I know I'm filming in my car, thank you random security person. I am here today to tell you that I know my account is all over the place. I know a lot of you that probably follow me, followed me because of my Disney days and when I was posting nothing but Frozen stuff and my trips to Disney World and everything like that. And since today is Easter and the Disney resorts have a lot of Easter displays, today we are going to go on an adventure through the four different resort hotels that have Easter displays and we're going to look at everything. So I've got my mask and we are headed off. After much longer waiting than I wanted to, we are finally on the bus to the Grand Floridian. This is Disney's Grand Floridian Resort and Spa. Please collect your belongings, watch your head and staff as you disembark, and take small children by the hand. We're here! Okay, I'm walking into the lobby. It's quiet out here and there's not as many people out here, so I figured I'd film here. But, uh, I've seen this display before. The other ones today that we're going to, I haven't seen yet. Um, of course there's probably new eggs this year, but I've been to the Contemporary for Easter before, is what I'm getting at. I want to ride in a carriage. This is a chocolate sculpture. It's Alice in Wonderland, I think, or is it just Humpty Dumpty? Who knows? Not me. I haven't found any other eggs for some reason, so we're just kind of looking around. The Grand Floridian is so pretty. The Grand Floridian has their own Bibbidi Bobbidi Boutique now. It's closed because it's Sunday. Also, I don't think they're doing it because of COVID. <laughs> you know, I always told myself that I could never see a reason why I would need to walk from the Grand Floridian to the Magic Kingdom. But it's a nice day out. It's cool. So we're going to walk the three quarters of a mile to Magic Kingdom to get the bus to the Saratoga Resort to see their Easter display because I couldn't find anything else at Easter besides that one egg here. There she is! The monorail! You can't see the castle from here. Oh wait, yes you can. There she is, isn't she beautiful? The hostess at the, uh, where you have your car parked. What is that called? Not chauffeur. Anyways, the attendant at the front told me that I could see everything on this walk around to the Magic Kingdom, so I hope this is a good view, and I hope I don't see any alligators coming towards me, because I'll cry. Hello, friend. You stay there. I'll stay here. And we'll be okay, yeah? Yeah. You're cute. So, that building right there is the wedding pavilion that has a window that looks straight at the castle. Okay, so where I'm standing now, you can see the castle just on the other side of those trees. And then we have the contemporary there the Ticket and Transportation Center, the Polynesian back over there, and the Grand Floridian. Finally found a bench with some shade, so we're just chilling, admiring the view for a little bit. It's, it's not cold out, it's like chill-ish. But that whole entire walking path had zero shade, so a break is nice. Okay, I lied. Uh, that building right there is not the wedding pavilion. This one over here, teeny tiny, that is the wedding pavilion. You can see right there in the middle, that is the window that showcases the castle. And you can get married right in front of that window. And it sounds like an absolute dream. Somebody come propose to me. 
All right, the monorail station is right up there and we are getting to the transportation hub here out front of the Magic Kingdom. So I am gonna hop the bus to Saratoga Springs and I will see you guys when I get there. I just did a double take because I looked over and I saw that that bus says WandaVision. So we are at Sarasota Springs. I have never been here before. There were several bus stops. I got off on the wrong one so I'm having to walk a little bit. I should have gotten off. That bus is up there. But I got off. Okay, I splurged a little bit since it is Easter and I got this cute little sponge cake that is very Easter. And then I figured when in Rome, drink some Saratoga still water at Saratoga Springs. All right, from here, I'm going to hop over to Disney Springs and get the bus to the Boardwalk Hotel. Look at the egg display there. And then we're gonna take the friendship boats from the boardwalk over to Yacht and Beach Club and see the eggs there. And then from there, we're gonna go back to Disney Springs. One, because I'm parked there. And two, because the ganachery has some boozy chocolate bunnies. And I'm gonna have to try one of those. So, I'm finished eating, so we're off to Disney Springs to get to the boardwalk. Okay, we are here at the boardwalk. Never actually been here. I've been outside walking from Epcot. But it says the lobby is this way, so let's go. Ava. Says, it says there's 10 hidden Mickeys. I will try to find them on my own. Oh, they're numbered. That's not too hard. But uh, let's see if we can find them. Okay, so there's one. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, six. Or eight, was that five? Oh, I've lost nine, count already. I don't know. Five. Maybe six. Seven. Eight. Nine. We did it, yay! <laughs> they have cute little seating areas all around here. Uh, I have no idea where I'm going. I'm just trying to get outside. But I also wanted to look around a little bit because like I said, I've never been in here before. So I'm hoping down this way there's an exit outside. So that over there is the pool. I saw it from a different window. It says exit over this way. Let's see. It says stairs, but to where? Did this go outside? I felt like a princess lost in a maze of hallways and doors that I don't know where they go to. This is pretty out here though. Am 
I going to end up walking to the yacht club? Who knows? Stay tuned. That might be the closest boat stop, so I might have to go over this bridge to get over there to it. So from here, Hollywood Studios is that way. This is the Swan and Dolphin, or the Swan and Dolphin. And back that way is Epcot and the Yacht Club. I lucked out. One just left, but another is coming. Lucky me. I did not luck out. This one is going to Hollywood Studios, not to the other resorts. Big side. Just to clear up what happened, um, I got confused over which side was which side. Uh, I have walked from Epcot all the way up to here before and taken the bus or the boat over, you know, around to get to Hollywood Studios. Uh, and the reason I got on the bus, the I keep calling it the bus, the boat. Uh, at Swan and Dolphin instead of this one over here is because the building that I walked out of at the boardwalk was closer to the Swan and Dolphin as opposed to walking all the way over here. So that is why I got on the boat there instead of at the boardwalk. So now we're going to go inside here at the beach club, Yacht and Beach Club, and see their Easter display. I like how they made it feel like it was a boardwalk all the way up to the entrance to the hotel. That's a really nice touch. That's the pool area over there. Um, so for COVID right now, you have to, it's basically like first come first serve at the pool and you have to get on like a wait list to get in later on in the day. It's a whole mess. I'm glad I don't have to deal with it. Okay, here are the eggs here at the Yacht and Beach. We have a Neverland Peter Pan themed one with Tink on the top, and then we have Aladdin with the Cave of Wonders and Jasmine and Raja on top, and then we have the uh, Mad Tea Party from Alice in Wonderland. Okay, so we've been to all four resorts that were on the Disney Parks blog that are listed as having any kind of Easter decorations. So like I mentioned before, we are going to head back to Disney Springs so that I can go to the Ganache and try one of their boozy chocolate Easter bunnies. So this is the line for Gideon's Bakehouse, which is a cookie shop that just opened this year. And there's always a long line, even with a virtual queue, because they're giant cookies and because it's new. And also it is Haunted Mansion themed, which I don't know if many people know that, but it is in fact Haunted Mansion themed. Here we are. There's a line and I am in it. So now we wait. There he is. The bunny boy. Now this one does have bourbon in it, which I've never had before, so that's gonna be an experience. But they did also have one that was a family drink. So it was just chocolate inside the chocolate bunny. And I wish I had gotten that because I don't know how much is in here and I have to drive home, so. Like I just said, I have never had bourbon before, so you get to see me try it for the first time. not bad. It's a little strong, but I'll live. I hope you can see me. I feel like it's really dark in the parking garage, but I'm back in my car. I had like half of that bunny and then I had to like dump it out because it was too strong for me and also because I'm about to drive. But uh, we did it. We did everything Easter related except I looked at the list on the Disney Parks blog and realized that there were like four different spots at the Yacht and Beach Club that had Easter stuff and I only went to one so rip but I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the Easter stuff at the Disney resorts I had fun going to all of them I did a lot more walking than I intended to and I was not in the shoes for it either so I am tired and hungry I haven't had anything to eat all day besides breakfast and that piece of cake 
and like half of that chocolate bunny. I kept the bunny. I just dumped all the alcohol out of it. Uh, so I'll be eating that later. But I'm going to go home. Thanks for watching. If you watch me for Marvel, I'll be back on Friday with an episode 4 discussion of Falcon and the Winter Soldier. Okay, this isn't going to stop anytime soon. So if you watch me for my regular videos, I'll be back on Wednesday with... I can't remember what I'm doing, but I promise it's going to be interesting. Oh yes, I'm going to be talking about my job. So, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And if you'd like to get notified when I post new videos, click that bell down below. I'm trying to hurry up before any cars start going off again. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful week. Bye!